Japanese cuisine is renowned globally for its delicate flavors, artful presentation, and emphasis on fresh, seasonal ingredients. Beyond taste, Japanese eating habits, table etiquette, and the cultural significance of food play a central role in the country's identity. Let's delve into the fascinating world of Japanese food culture, exploring unique eating habits, interesting facts, and the preference for using cups. 1. Japanese Eating Habits Japanese eating habits are deeply ingrained in the culture. Meals are often served in small portions, emphasizing variety and balance. It's common to see a combination of rice, fish or meat, vegetables, and pickles in a traditional Japanese meal. The practice of itadakimasu, before a meal, a form of gratitude, reflects respect for the food and its origins. 2. Eating in Cups Japanese cuisine often incorporates the use of cups for various dishes. Rice bowls, noodle bowls, and teacups are ubiquitous. The aesthetic appeal of using cups enhances the dining experience. And it also allows for portion control. Moreover, it aligns with the Japanese principle of appreciating each bite by focusing on taste and texture. 3. Fun and interesting facts. Sushi evolution. Sushi, a staple of Japanese cuisine, originally served as a preservation method for fish. It has evolved from a simple preservation technique to an artful delicacy known worldwide. Ramen diversity. Ramen, a beloved Japanese noodle dish, has numerous regional varieties. Each region takes pride in its unique broth, noodles, and toppings, showcasing the diverse flavors within Japan. Kaseki cuisine. Kaseki is a traditional multi-course Japanese meal, often served in ryokan, inns, or high-end restaurants. It's a culinary art that emphasizes seasonal ingredients and presentation, reflecting Japanese aesthetics. The art of slurping noodles in Japan, a cultural tale. Slurping noodles is akin to a gustatory symphony. The act aerates the noodles, allowing the flavors to burst forth, and the aroma to dance in the air. It isn't just about making noise, it's about enveloping the senses in the full essence of the dish. Japanese noodles are often served piping hot. Slurping cools them down as they are brought from bowl to mouth, achieving the ideal temperature for immediate consumption. It's all about savoring the noodles at the precise moment of perfection. Not too hot and not too cold. Slurping is a cultural norm, an accepted and appreciated practice in Japan, especially when it comes to noodles. It signifies enjoyment and satisfaction with the meal. Just as bowing is a sign of respect, slurping noodles is a symbol of gratification and gratitude towards the chef. Slurping allows the Japanese to embrace their noodles in a lively, unreserved manner, enjoying every aspect of the dish, from aroma to texture. It's an embodiment of being present and engaging fully with the food. A way of showing genuine enthusiasm for the culinary experience. When everyone at a table is engaged in the artful act of slurping, it creates a communal ambience, a shared celebration of good food. The unity in slurping mirrors the unity in appreciating the rich, diverse tapestry of Japanese cuisine. The tradition of slurping noodles has historical roots. It originated from the desire to consume noodles quickly due to their soft texture. Over generations, what began as practicality transformed into a cultural symbol. Retaining its essence and gaining meaning beyond its origins. Slurping adds a sensory layer to the dining experience, nourishing not only the body but also the soul, leaving a lasting imprint of the meal. Every slurp is a journey, an adventure into the depths of taste and appreciation, leaving behind a memory of flavors savored. Like and subscribe to explore more insights.